Hello and welcome back viewers and subscribers of AVG News. My name is Olisi, the son of Nube. Uh, this is a follow-up to an earlier video that we posted on this uh, website, on this YouTube channel, whereby we reported that somebody purporting to be the Interim Secretary General of C, that is the Citizens Coalition for Change in Zimbabwe, uh, has written to the Speaker of Parliament advocate Jacob Ntenda uh, seeking the recall or purporting to be recalling members of the mainstream opposition party uh, from the House of Assembly, that is the National House of Assembly, and some from the local government. So this guy uh, wrote to advocate Mutenda and said that he was recalling people who were elected on a triple C ticket whom he said or he claimed had ceased to be members of the political party. He didn't give the reasons or the yeah the reasons why these people had ceased or how they had ceased to be members of triple C. And as I had said, we all know that triple C doesn't have uh, the position uh, of secretary general at the moment because it doesn't have any structures that have been explained to anybody. So the party has now responded to this uh, letter, which we are told has already reached the Speaker of Parliament. We haven't yet been uh, given any direction as to what is going to happen in Parliament, but we hope that for the benefit of democracy, this letter is thrown away because for all we know, Triple C doesn't have a secretary general and therefore this Chabangu guy is not representative of what he claims to be representing so i'll go through a letter written by triple c you will remember also that in our earlier video i stated that the only people that have what are said to be substantive uh, position in the party uh, is the president Nelson Chamisa, that is advocate Nelson Chamisa, uh, the spokesperson, the national spokesperson, who is Mr. Promise Mkwananzi, and his deputy, who is Gift Ostalos Siziba. So, the letter now that we have is from Mr. Siziba, that is Gift Ostalos Siziba, uh, from the Triple C Communications team. And he says, I'm going to read this. It has come to the attention of the Citizens Coalition for Change that there are letters purportedly written by a person designating himself as Interim Secretary General circulating on social media claiming that the Citizens Movement has recalled named councillors and members of Parliament. Members of the public are advised to disregard this with contempt they deserve. The Triple C Party has neither recalled nor does intend nor does it intend to recall any of its recently elected deployees. The purported author of the two letters, Sengezo Chavangu, is not and has never been a member or official of the Triple C party since its inception. His last known parties are MTCT and PDP. He is renowned for being the proxy of fielding fake Triple C double candidates in Bulawayo and Matebelele North. The citizens' movement is taking action against this imposter and all his contacts. The, the, this deplorable behavior by ZANU-PF is a response to their defeat in 2023 and rejection by Zimbabwe and a pathetic attempt to respond to the exercise of our freedom of association in not attending the official opening of parliament yesterday that is 3 october 2023 meanwhile our deployees in local authorities and parliament should continue to discharge their responsibilities as mandated by the electorate in the just elect in the just ended elections signed gift ostalos siziba so this is the letter that we're talking about which has been written uh, by uh Mr. Siziba, but of course we don't uh, want to be part of the labeling of other people 
as stooges of ZANU PF or of ZANU PF uh, unfairly as the ones who are behind this. But of course, this is political banter, this is political uh, propaganda. It's allowed for them to state this. But as a news uh, organization, we've just read out what they wrote without implying anything. So stand uh, informed that the so called letter that has been written to the Speaker of Parliament is not officially from the Citizens Coalition for Change and Mr. Sengezo Chavangu is not recognized in the party as what he claims to be, that is the interim secretary general of the party because there is no such position. If it's there, it's never been made public. And we look forward to uh, what the Speaker of Parliament is going to do or what Parliament is going to do. But we hope that in the interest of democracy, this doesn't continue to cascade or to degenerate into a situation uh, of chaos like what happened to the MTC Alliance. Thank you very much. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like this video and share it.